Yo, what's up, peeps? XL Grinder here, and today we're gonna play a little bit more Mass Effect 3. Um, actually, we're gonna do um, a map Firebase Giant on Gold. Uh, with me today, I'm gonna have Anakai Ninja, Manson, and Brandon Lee. So I gotta say uh, thanks a lot, fellas, for joining me on this and helping me get through the map. So what we're gonna do is each week we're gonna bring you a strategy on how to get a map done on Gold. Um, this week we chose Firebase Giant, but if any of anybody who watches this vid, you know, if you have a selection for a map you'd like to see a strategy for for next week's vid, please leave it under the comments and uh, have enough votes on it and I'll get it done and you'll see the vid. Our strategy for this is going to be exactly the same way it was for a Firebase White. We're going to pick a building where we can stay in close proximity to each other. Just in case one of us go down, you know, we need to be able to pick each other up quickly. Now, we are on goal. I stress that again. Um, we also want to have a location where we have good uh, proximity to ammunition. Uh, we happen to have a location that's right to my left right down the ladder and there's another one down the ramp on my right so that means that Manson is covered and Ninja and I are also covered on our end. Now another thing you definitely want to have when you're, when you're playing gold on any map uh, you, you definitely want to try to have long lines of sight so that's why you know this is also a good location uh, as you can see Ninja and I can pick things off from a long way and uh, Manson and and Brandon are having the same thing on their end. Uh, they have nice long lines of sight and they're picking stuff off. I think this map may be a little bit more of a challenge than White was just because of the sheer size of the map. I think the enemy may have a few more ways to get, you know, get to us, but we're gonna see. Everything seems to be going well so far. Haven't had any problems. Hey, and as you see, Ninja and I are having a good time in the middle. He's on warp on, and I'm on throw, so we're causing some nice biotic explosions here to clear him out. Um, like As I said before in the last video, that is always the best way to go. Um, make sure that you plan your team wisely. Pick people or pick jobs that work, in, you know, work good together, where you can do biotic explosions, where you can do tech bursts, where you can clear, where you can clear large amounts of enemies at one time. And that will always get you get you through a gold run every time. I tell you, it seems like these atlases just do not want to go down. Look at them. Just taking the biotic explosions. Uh, okay, moving on to wave six. We got a hack in the middle of the map. This is one of the worst places, the worst things to have on this map. A hack right here in the middle. Uh, Giant probably has some of the worst hacking spots on any map in this game. Uh, a lot of the spots that it has are wide open. Uh, there are a couple of good ones that put you in buildings, but there are like three really bad ones and this is definitely one of them so we're gonna make our way through this and uh, we're not gonna fail not at all
Oh my goodness, we made it to wave seven. Just barely. As you can see, that was crazy. As, as, as I said, it's, you know, having a hack position in an open spot in the middle of Firebase Giant with servers and phantoms is just not uh, the best thing. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we had fun with that round, to say the least. But we are moving on now. We're going to continue to pick them off and make our way to wave 10. Because wave 10 is where the money is. And uh, if you don't make any money, then you can't get any weapons. And that sucks. Here we are at wave 10, the money round, and we have to disable some devices. Uh, the plan is for us to let uh, one guy, which is our infiltrator, run around and get the devices while the rest of us just kind of bring the enemy towards us. We just run the distraction, keep everybody coming towards our way, so that way he can just run around and get everything we need, and the money will be ours. Now we have one remaining enemy for the wave and that is Atlas. And as you can see Atlas is chilling on top of the building. <laughs> That's just one of the weird things that happens in this game. I'm not I'm not, I'm not sure if you noticed it, but um there was an invisible phantom that was slaying us when we were in here getting those devices on the la on earlier in this round. But I just want to tell you, thank you very much for coming out and watching another exclusive gamers vid. And we will catch you next time. Later.